Billy Bass here. So they put out the Kong Survival Instinct reveal trailer. Um, we, we know the story is uh, not Joel from The Last of Us has where he's going to save his, looks like possibly college graduate daughter from events that happened in Godzilla versus Kong. And it looks like it's going to be it's going to be a game and uh, opinions are divided already, but it's a 2.5 D 2.5 D has where you're confined to the, the two dimensional plane. So you left, right up and down. There could be transitions from cut scenes or in game uh, kind of movement and stuff that has where you kind of like may change perspective to a different angle of the two-dimensional uh background uh if you will like like limbo like in inside like little monster well little, little nightmares it's it's all like that it's a survival metroidvania kind of game there and if you know anything about seven levels or if you look them up it's it's you're not gonna play as kong you're not playing as Kong in this game. There's not a chance. Uh, the, you, you could have where you have a, a nice cutscene or a nice uh, interstition, stuff like that, which would be cool. I mean, like, you know, we, we, we like giant monsters because we like seeing giant monsters fight, not the melodrama of human life. The only time that's ever kind of like really worked for me is in the original Godzilla and Godzilla Minus One. Where it's like, hey, you know, like I want to see more of these characters. I want to see, you know, stuff like that. That's that's the only time it's really, really stood out for me. Uh, but yeah, seven levels there. They, here's some games they put out. They put out Football Cup 2021 through 2024, uh, Castle Heart, and Jet Cave, which is a game about a caveman who gets a jetpack. These are all. Budget, I would say budget titles, because right now I think both Castle Heart and Jet Cave are on sale on Nintendo Switch, and uh, half the Football Cup games are on sale. But but back to back to Kong Survival Instinct. It's it looks like it could be a real fun game if you are a fan of Inside Limbo. Little nightmares. If you're if you're a fan of that style of game and you want to play as a person trying to find his daughter, which is just, I mean, it's 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 not a bad idea for a game. I mean, it's not. I don't want to say it's cliche, but I mean, like, hey, as long as the gameplay loop is fun, it could be great. Um, it looks like Titanus uh, Abaddon or Cloverfield mishmash with a sculpture from Legend of Zelda. Uh, is is gonna be menacing you, and I do like, I do like those kind of little. Uh, I don't want to say it's like quick time event, but but it has where it's like, hey, you're you're trying to get through the level, and this giant monster is 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 messing it up for you. It's causing more issues. It's it's annoying the crap out of you because it's, it's it's ruining your day. But I mean that's a, that's that's the point of these games. Um, the design's not bad. I mean, like it, it looks it looks fun. I don't know why it has a skull on its back. Why it why is why it evolved to have a skull? Uh, but but it looks cool. I'm not gonna say it doesn't look cool. It looks cool. Uh, Tiamat is shown in like the end screen some, so you probably run into a few more titans through the game. Uh, I don't. I really do. If if somehow they have where you play is. Kong, I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna break out of the normal gameplay loop for that. But nothing in here shows you playing as Kong. Everything has where it looks like it's like the interstitial cutscene, or like you got to a point where it's like, hey, you know, let let me use the orca to be like Kong, come come save my butt because I'm a little person being menaced by a Titan, and I don't know why the Titan cares so much for this little bitty person who is barely anything, probably in its diet. Just, just put it out there. If anything, it looks, it looks better than Skull Island: Rise of Kong. It's got that going for it. But 
is it the game that people who are fans of giant monsters, kaiju in general, want? Because I know I would love I would love for another Godzilla Destroyal Monsters Melee or Godzilla Save the Earth. Um, those games were like fantastic for me. I also I also love um, I was it a uh, War of the Monsters. War of the Monsters is a fantastic PS2 game. Uh, that fan I, I I love brawlers like that. I love those. You're just like open area. You got you got your you got your level, and you just beat the crap each other. You destroy the environment. That's my that's my favorite type of game with giant monsters there. But I I would love to see even with just, if it was just confined to the monster verse and didn't have where it went to like the 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 wider spectrum of of Toho movies and whatever something if you want to play as a person have it like Shadow of the Colossus that that was a fantastic game had where it it had a sense of size and other than having where each titan well each colossus in that had where it was in a sense a, a puzzle if it had where you could just interact like that um what was it they had a uh, I think it was a couple of years ago now. Uh, Call of Duty Warzone had an event where you could fight Kong and Godzilla. That was that was close, but without the kind of annoyance of a multiplayer uh, Godzilla, well, multiplayer online game. Because like I, I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of them. You know, people are. I'm not, I'm not knocking them. But uh, if it was if it was like that, if you want to have where some, you play as a person, have that going for you. That, that would be a little bit more compelling for me. But tell me what you think down in the comments below. Is, is Kong Survival Instinct your type of game? Is it what you want to do? Do you want to play as just the person? Do you just want to play as the dad from Last of Us? I'm sorry. He just looks – he reminds me of Joel. It just seems like it's like, hey, you know, we're going to have a stereotype, and it's the slightly grizzled, gruff dad. Who has where he's gonna save his child? It's it's a stereotype. It, I, I I'm not. God. There's other things they can do. I just want them to do something else besides. Hey, every everything is a dad saving his child. Why is there so much danger in the world that this is this is the game we always get? Dad, save a kid. I don't know. Or what? Tell me what type of game that you would like to see with kaiju uh from the monsterverse from toho etc i would love to hear that tell me what you think down below in the comments please like share and subscribe and you know if it's the first time on your channel uh leave some more comments i don't know i love hearing from y'all love interacting with y'all i i hit 2000 subscribers i appreciate you all thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video later guys